Bro, we don't got no more sugar. So, child. So you using the rest of the sugar. Child, we got no more sugar. Bobby, can you please help me find the keys? What you Bobby? <laughs> They're in, Mom, where are your keys? Where I are your cards? Are they in your purse? Guys, so what is something that you want to work on for 2020, Mom? That you know, that like we tell you all the time, like, oh my God, what is something you want to get better at? You know? Being a better person, being more spiritually connected. Because at this point, you guys have developed and who you're going to be. You are who you are at this point. Me? Both of you, all, all three of you. So the choices you choose to make, you guys are adults. <laughs> <laughs> you are who you are. I'm proud of that. Well, you yeah. Know, you know, I'll still be there for advice and for guidance, but you are little people. You have your own mind. You make people. your you make your decisions, and hopefully, whatever I've instilled in you guys, you'll continue to make positive decisions. But outside so what's, of that, what's something you think that? I should work on for 2020. You maybe being more aggressive in basketball and taking more chances. What about me? But not basketball wise. Basketball? So basketball wise, you know, aggressiveness, you know, take more chances. Mm -hmm. Okay. But outside of that, I think, I think you look great. Sydney, I think you uh -oh. need to read more and build your vocabulary. <laughs> okay, not academically. <laughs> I just think you should read more. It'll make as you a well-rounded individual. Okay, besides that, as a person. Work on not being so moody when things don't go your Ooh, way. Jesus, thank you. <laughs> no, today? Say a lot of because it's about back. trying to be a better person and you take some of your weaknesses and turn them into your strengths. And it's like, people, you think people are gonna move the freaking mountains for you all the time. Okay, what do you guys think that I could work on? So one thing I think you should work on is actually being on time. <laughs> you are like, I'm not trying to say anything, but you are literally never on time for anything. Uh-oh. Like, I'm not trying oh, to say so you anything. Can this enough. That's what like. <laughs> no, I'm not trying to say anything bad, like at all. But, shoot. I'm always early to work. Yeah. I'm, sometimes I'm the first teacher at work. Oh, well, I ain't no way that's true. <laughs> <laughs> I think I changed my word, but I stole my friend's word. What is it? But I like it. Intentional. Mm, I do like that. What's your word for 2020? Explain my word. your word. Explain your word. I changed my word. Wait, but wait, wait. So. You never told me what you think I should work on as a person other than wait, Oh wait, you did tell me. Sorry. Yeah, so me. moody. Oh. Okay. What do you think I should work on as a person? You know how I always interrupt you? Yeah. Okay. So today when we're at the church, <laughs> the way I was talking to Lizzie and she's like starting something, I was like, and you that's when you sent me a picture of the sweet potatoes. I was like, oh my gosh, my sister was making the sweet potatoes and I like interrupt her. <laughs> and she was like Sydney, I literally just started a conversation with Lizzie. So show your popcorn, Clint. Clint just made some kettle corn, y'all. It's got like cool down. Okay, no more for me. It's like a big. Mm -hmm. Is it still too hot? So who was saying something? Who was saying something? And you cut her off. Yeah. You cut her off. I'm saying, what do you think I should work on as a person's name? Um, maybe not getting so upset when I ask for your clothes. <laughs> but I think that's something we can honestly both. But I don't on. even. Okay, Cindy, what do you think I'm gonna work just on? Like, us being nicer to each other. I feel like we're very nice to each other. Yeah, but like, 
I, I can see how I can like get like kind of like aggravated sometimes for like no reason, but like, but sorry. But I think like one thing for us is like when you ask to wear clothes, like if you think about it, like it's just materialistic stuff. It's not like you're asking me to borrow my arm or something, you know? And I think sometimes we make it seem like that. So maybe we can both work on that a little bit more. Mm -hmm. A little more lenient? Mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. <laughs> um, hmm. Maybe just not getting upset over the little thing. Not get upset over you asking me for a drive every five minutes? Yeah. Um, okay. Actually, Mom, Ooh. I got transportation from, like, from, I think, three different people yesterday. Kinsey picked me up for breakfast, took me home for breakfast. No, this was... No, this wasn't yesterday. This was Saturday. She picked me up for breakfast, dropped me off for breakfast. Becca picked me up, brought me to Lily's house, brought me back home to pick up my Bible, went to her house, and then brought me back home. But guess what, y'all? I'm about to get my license, so. Right, Mom? Mm -hmm. Basically, for the new year, there's this thing where you come up with a word of the year, which is like a word that you're gonna like, I guess, live by for the year. And so, like, for example, your word could be, you know, confidence. So throughout the year, you're going to live life more confidently, you know, something like that. Um, so I'm still kind of undecided on my word. It has a lot. I'm going to think about it. So what's your word? So I was debating between rebuild and growth, but... My friend pointing out pointed out to me that those are like basically the same, so I could decide between one of those. But my friend's word is intentional, and like, like you're not really supposed to base your word off of like your friend's word or like what someone thinks your worship your word should be, but more basing it off of like what you think you can personally work on and where you think you can grow. So, um, but I'm listening. So. I like my friend's word is intentional and I don't want it to be like oh like I really like your word but like <laughs> like I feel like intentional being intentional with relationships and friendships and like I know this is like dumb but like being intentional with my school work and like school in general is something that I can really work on so I think I'm gonna pick intentional um but yeah sorry Becca <laughs> <laughs> Just so her word. Yeah. But it's like, it's like not like that, you know? It's like what yeah. you think you can work so on. So you also, she just gave you the idea. Like, oh, that's a good word. I should use it. Yeah, I'm kind of just like, intentional has been like, like a word that I heard a lot today. Because in our meeting, we use the word intentional a lot. So, yeah. So, back to me, sis. Back to me. <laughs> I'm going to do my word after you did you did your word, Bobby? No, I haven't explained the word, but I'm still thinking about my. No, you can do your too. Oh, you still thinking about your word? Well, I was eating some of uh, Clinton's good popcorn. It's good. We got to show you that recipe, too. <laughs> Kettle corn popcorn, but we make it from scratch, from the kernel. So, anyway, I thought about my word. I really couldn't come up with anything. I thought about perseverance because I've had to overcome. Ooh. I really need to be working on that book. <laughs> I had to overcome so much. But perseverance is like you're still overcoming. You're still on that grind. You're still trying to make it. I want to move past that. So I thought about tranquility. Because I feel as though after you have persevered through all those steps and mountains and monuments, you get to that tranquil state of mind and that's my ultimate goal whether it's that forgiveness in my heart being a better person showing kindness showing love to others and so on and so forth so it's like i just want that ultimate peace whether it's financial just that peace where i don't have that worry that stress so that's what um my goal is and if i can overcome so many things it's like i'm still try um, striving for that tranquility 
perseverance, I feel as though you're still in a storm. You're still trying to overcome X, Y, and Z. I'm tired of, tired of that. It's like, I'm, I just want to be at peace. Does that make sense? So I think my word is going to be tranquility. And we are going to do a creative um, way to always have that word in our face. And we're going to show you what we guys do with that word. Mm -hmm. So I'm excited. So Bobby, you still thinking about your word? So what would be your word for 2020? Leave it in the comments section below. Okay, so I'm not really sure. I've had like a lots of words that I thought I was going to do. I was going to do the word. <laughs> I was going to do the word forward. Because I, you know, just keep moving forward, keep doing what I'm doing. But then I watched, I recently watched this video. And it was basically like, I think it was a sports video. And it was just like, it was just a really good video. Like of people saying like, I can't do this, I can't do this. But they put such emphasis on the word yet. That I think I'm going to do that as my word. Because it's like, like I haven't done this, I, I can't do this. But... I haven't I want to change my mindset and say like I haven't done this yet or I can't do this yet so to always say like yes I haven't done something but I'm gonna eventually do it because that's just like who I am like I'm not just gonna give up on something I'm gonna just keep trying to do it so I'm thinking I'm doing my word is yet mom mm -hmm. you want this? oh yeah I'm okay. you want but that? you know what I mean mm-hmm you know what I mean? Like, I don't know how to explain it very well, but it's just like... So you're going to put yet? Yeah, because like in the video, they put emphasis on that, a lot of emphasis on that word. Like, I can't do this. But it's not that you can't do it, it's just you can't do it yet. So just to never like give up and say, oh, I can't do it and just not do it. It's just, you'll eventually do it. Like, you know? I didn't make it. Yes. yes. <laughs> But like, I will. Yeah. So it's like, you know, it's cool. I like that, Bobby. Maybe so, Clay, you what's your word of the year? Word? You haven't been listening to the conversation? Improvement. Ooh, okay. Okay. Powerful. What did he say? Improvement. Okay. So make sure you like and subscribe and make sure you comment down below your word of the year. So, Lena. <laughs> We're trying to get a fly. <laughs> That's funny. There you go.